As a mother of a 14-year-old, it means absolutely everything to know that Revive Our Hearts is there for the next generation. I've really found comfort in the biblical teaching that I heard. I listen on the internet is how I get most of my listening of Revive Our Hearts and just be able to turn it on and listen to it and be encouraged to walk further in my walk. I feel like when I listen to that podcast, I just have this amazing opportunity to sit at Nancy's feet as she opens the Word and rightly divides the Word of Truth, and it just so encourages me. I'm so refreshed and challenged to be um, you know, a better mother and a better wife and a better ministry leader. We're so grateful for God's provision of the largest matching challenge in our history. We're praying that He will help us meet the entire challenge and beyond between now and December 31st. Your gift this month will help keep our current outreaches strong. Plus, you'll be helping us expand those outreaches to touch even more women's lives in the days ahead. Thanks so much for your part in making this ministry possible. I've never been a part of a ministry where um, they call me and they say, how can I pray for you when, you know, I'm the one that's wanting to be a ministry partner with them. I know that there are people who give their money to the, the support of this ministry and what they gave that made it ha possible that day for me to hear has had a huge effect on myself and my family. My immediate family, my husband, loves that I listen to Revive Our Hearts. My kids are too little to know yet, but I hope that they will someday say the same. My sister, my aunt, my friends, thank the people that made it possible for me to happen to hear it that day and to continue hearing it.